hi gemini and welcome back to my channel today i'll be channeling messages focusing on who is your secret admirer and why haven't they come forth and told you that they are your secret admirer so before i begin let me introduce myself my name is alexa tarot and i am a second degree reiki practitioner as well as an intuitive tarot and oracle reader i want to start off by saying thank you to each and every one of my subscribers my new viewer and visitors alike thank you so much for your love your support and your loyalty to our channel i greatly appreciate it continue to like share and subscribe so that i can continue to bring you these channeled messages all right gemini so today again like i said this is all about the secret admirer who is this person and why haven't they told you that they are interested in you all right so let's begin all right let's find out who this person is so this person has the one who emerges okay so this deck says she for every single card please note this is not a gendered reading so i will replace she with the name with uh the uh the person okay so this person here um i feel here this person has known you for a very long time or has uh may have a history with you so this person has been looking at you from a distance for a while they've been observing you they've been trying to get to know your heart here for some of you for some of you again this person the secret when i mean social circle i mean this could be a colleague this could be um a, a person a friend okay or a friend of a friend but there is a social circle here so this person knows you this person sees you um and i feel here that this person has been looking at you um and they haven't um fully uh come out to let you know that they are interested um because i feel here that there is some sense of feeling like either the there's this feeling here of rejection or feeling scared that you, they may be rejected here okay this person has gone through a lot of emotional situations here especially by looking at the lotus and it's coming across to me as <clears throat> someone who's been able to be resilient okay there there's there's resiliency about this person who's been uh who, who doesn't give up this person doesn't give up easily and in regards to you and the fact that they are your secret admirer um they have been looking at you they have been observing you uh for quite some time here she is looking at the uh, left here and the left is always indicative to me to the past okay so again this person is looking towards the past and looking at what looks like a flower a red flower but is really coming across to me as the heart like they looking at your heart they're observing your heart they've um they've even fallen in love with the way you are the heart your generosity your 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 kindness okay let's take a look here they have here the web weaver uh, synchronicity divine intelligence cause and effect there's a connection here between you and this person that has been either destiny or it has been this um what i'm what i'm picking up here is like there's this connection of coincidences having to do with this person and you okay so whether you met them in a very kind of like synchronous way or kind of like not expecting uh to come across them when you met them but there is this and again you have two cards that are looking in the past okay so this person may it may be someone you know for a very long time okay here gemini there may be someone here that you may have known for a very long time that has this um this kind of longing it's like they long i'm getting this feeling like they long for you they they yearn to talk to you or they learn they yearn to communicate with you they're very quiet of course they don't want you to know this is why they are your secret admirer but there's this like connection of coincidences here between you and this person or this person and you whether it is that um you guys bump into each other in a in, in a in a kind of like a interesting way from time to time or whenever you are thinking about them gemini they come out of the you know out of the woodworks here and you know they, they they may reach out to you okay but there is some type of synchronicitous events here surrounding you and this person this person is intuitive okay this person um may at times again 
they may be thinking about you and you kind of text them and say hi how are you or you may be thinking about them and sometimes um you pop up in that way okay so just kind of keep that in mind here milk and honey this person is happy go lucky this person has a lot of positivity happening around them because they have experienced a sense of heartache and pain in the past okay so they know what it is to suffer or to have uh wounding and and hurt okay and and i'm getting that because of this rainbow okay in order for the rainbow to come out there has to be the sense of rain okay of things of, of the storm right so they've endured a certain type of storm here in regards to their life and of course they have also here the lotus which again you know uh kind of rises from this muddy water so this person is very uh ambitious okay they're go-getters they don't allow uh things in life to get in their way okay um they don't allow um little stumbles or obstacles and challenges to define who they are okay they kind of like go above and beyond okay is what i'm feeling here let's take a look here at what else who is this person uh gemini's secret admirer who is gemini's secret admirer here i'm gonna be moving this right here so you guys could see it your secret admirer all right calling in your soulmate yeah there's something here having to do with this person really remember that i told you that earlier there's this in intuitive communication there's this sense of uh, synchronicity between you and this person this connection um that you know this person has with you they do feel here gemini that either there are qualities about you that check off their boxes in regards to the type of person that they would like to uh, have or start a relationship or can you know continue uh, to get to know but on a level of more of um, you know of more than just friends okay there is something here that they feel very connected to you Gemini so whether it is that they feel that you've been their soulmate maybe in a past life or there is this sense of a Affinity. there's this soul connection here this person has with you you may also feel that okay with this person all right so just giving you a heads up however this person feels that either one or two things either they are physically separated uh with you so for some of you this may, this may be a long distance uh this person may be at a distance which again i kept feeling the sense of longing or yearning um here earlier but um this makes sense now looking at this card separation they may be physically separated from you in other words they are in one location and you are in another location for others of you this person feels so connected to you there is some sense of such a soul to soul connection that they feel that they need to step back and create some type of distance between you and them okay it's like they don't want to tell you they don't want you to know it's like for whatever reason this person doesn't want you to fully be aware that you know that your presence or your um maybe even your friendship is something that tugs in their heart okay there's a sense here um that this person has been praying has been visualizing has been hoping that they may get a chance here with you gemini okay in some way shape or form let's take a look here at more information who is this secret admirer that gemini has here counseling you heal with kind words wise advice and empathetic here yeah this person may be a friend this person may be someone that you have known for a very long time who has listened to you who has heard um you know maybe you have uh, this person you've confided with this person gemini things that you uh you know your thoughts your fears okay maybe you know again this person is in your social circle so there is some type of connection that you have had with this person and through 
you know, talking to you, through getting to know you, um, this person, okay, so I'm getting two things. So either you have advised this person or this person has advi has given you advice. Or there's this feeling of both parties, you, Gemini, and this person, your secret admirer, talking. There's a lot of communication here. So whether it's that you guys have been talking for a very long time, have known each other for a very long time, but there's this feeling here of this person who, um, who's very kind. And um, what I'm getting here, it says kind words. And the first thing that popped into my mind clairvoyantly here uh, about this person, Gemini, is they may uh, be very strong with words of affirmation. Okay, this person may be uh, uh, very, when I say strong, I mean, they, they come across, they tell you things, they're good communicators, okay? And we all know that there are five love languages, right? And even though this person may be a friend, there is something here about what they say and how they say it or the sense of expressing themselves. So this person may be very strong in the sense of words of affirmation okay the chaser all right so this person has not come forth okay gemini to tell you um about their feelings for you for the the you know for one reason this is one of many i still have another uh, deck here that i want to shuffle here for you guys um the chaser is this person may fear um rejection this person may fear that they don't want to chase. They don't want to come across as someone who's chasing you, okay, uh, which is another reason. I feel here that they also have fear of abandonment, okay? There may be some type of situation here from their past or recent past that they fear being abandoned or they fear being rejected. And that may be the reason here. Uh, Gemini that this person hasn't come forth to tell you or to even share with you um, that they uh, want more than just a high and by or casual type of relationship or connection with you okay all right let's take a look here at this last deck what else can we learn here about this person for Gemini who is Gemini's secret admirer and why they haven't come forth. Let's see. They have ancient wisdom, the lady with a boshed egg. Okay. So I feel here that this person, okay, there's something here coming across to me as this person is very wise. I, I said it before. Your secret admirer is someone who's very wise. Um, they're either wise beyond their years or they're highly intuitive, okay? And I feel here that the reason that this person hasn't uh, come forth is like I said before, there's this feeling that I'm getting here with this cracked egg is like they've gone through um, a lot in their past. They've, they've had their feelings hurt and they're afraid uh, to come forth and be hurt emotionally okay there may be again the fear may be overpowering okay now whether we want to call it fear that we want to call it you know they're just very cautious okay but there is the sense here that this person is cautious this person doesn't want to um to chase there may have been here um in some of the conversations that you and this person may have had here uh, without you even knowing, Gemini, maybe you have said something that may have caused this person to say, you know what, I don't think that Gemini will um, will receive um, the message that I'm interested in them, uh, you know, and they've kind of shut off or they've pulled back. Okay, so there may have been something here. Oh, for some of you, I mean, for some of you, you may be in a relationship. Or this person may be in a relationship. But either way, there's this feeling here of kind of fearing to take that step forward um, because of either fear of getting hurt or fear of abandonment or fear of rejection. Gemini, I hope that these messages were insightful. Click here on the Luxatero logo to be part of the Luxatero family and click down here for more free messages. Take care.